a month before Series X came out, Microsoft had Design Labs, which they closed, where you can make custom controllers. And on the last day of it, I ordered this because I wasn't particularly uh, interested in um, getting the Series X or S. And then, of course, I did. Now, uh, this one, this one had an accident. Destiny 2 was related. So... They've opened up them again, and I ordered another controller. I can even open this one properly, because I blanked out all the information, except my name. Ooh, obligatory tapping. Now, I have already opened this. This is like my Series X controller. This is, I've got the red one, the green one, the black one, the white one. Because <laughs> they came, I've got the Series S and Series X. mean to think, hey, did he just unbox the same controller? And you're not completely wrong. <laughs> I want the exact same design again. Well, apart from the back, actually. Actually, I just went for the whole one. But I went for pretty much the exact same design again. And uh, it looks great. I even got my gamer tag. So let's see if anyone pays attention and tries that. Let me show me. I don't play games. I reject everything. But you can watch my achievements if you want. So. The difference has been in these ones. USB-C charging. Micro USB. It's still, I don't understand why the Xbox Series X still has this antiquated um, proprietary plug-in thing for stuff that no one uses. So this was used for a text pad. Oh god sake, that fucking dog. For the text pad and you know because the original one didn't have a head to mount so it's got a much better D button. Although I prefer the way this one looks. Uh, I went for the traditional colours this time as well. I just bought the same controller whenever I just need to. <laughs> so there we go. Uh, 